What's going on everyone? We're here, 24 Hour Le Mans with Ford Performance. Uh, we're going to be out here checking out the race. We've never been before, it's the first time, so it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, Bronson did a lot of the driving down here, bigger. Because 75% I was, I, of the driving. I was tired, man. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. I'm looking forward to this. We came down in the, uh, what, what was the car that we came down in? Mustang GT, drop top, V8, 5 litre engine. What, 450 brake horse? Amazing. It sounds dirty. Yeah, and a I lot mean, dirty. Yeah, sounds yeah. amazing. Yeah, yeah. But anyway, guys, we're going to check it out. We have to do some briefing, see what's going on. And yeah, I'm excited, man. Yeah, we're going to go do the boring bit and then we're going to go check out some cars. Yes, All sir. Right. Uh, Boom. So, we're about to get on the main track right now. So, we're going to be driven around the hot lap in the Ford Mustang Bullet. So, this is special edition. Jeez. These are rapid manual, manual gearbox and uh, yeah I'm excited man. How is it to get you one of these to see what it's all about? Let's go see, let's go check it out. That was sick. Um, so imagine that these guys drive around that track 24 hours, go round and round and round in that. That's incredible, man. This is this thing is so quick. Like the name bullet is no joke. It goes and it sounds amazing as well. I wish we actually drove one of these from London, you know. Boom. So today, without the word, we're actually going to be driving the bullets today. So this is number 41 out of uh, however many that produced these, and this is going to be sick. So we're going to go for a drive down the countryside and uh, just get some shots and see what this actually drives like. It's gonna be sick. Marcus is out there, Marcus Bronzy from Out to Kill an Hour is out there just taking some shots as well. So this should be sick. This is manual as well, so this is the bullet edition and it should be sick. Let's see what that's about. You ready? So ready, too ready, come on man. Bullets. Bullets, bullets. bullets. We did a little bit of uh, car spotting, there's a uh, McLaren 650S yeah, over there behind us somewhere. There's another McLaren in front of me, with orange. Two Lambos. Two Lamborghinis parked up and uh, there's a Porsche as well. Yeah, classic and cars. Classic cars over there somewhere, I'm not interested. <laughs> uh, and then there's an M4 and an M2 as well. I love the M4 man. Yeah. If, if there's a BMW that I like, it's the M4. There's also a Ford GT knocking around as well. We might be driving it, someone needs to have a word. Hey. Boom, so we just got here and this is quite significant actually. We got here and I thought, why is there so many cars? But we found out that this hotel behind me, this Hotel de France, is actually where the 24 hour Le Mans drivers, this is where they come to chill, have lunch. Some of the rooms are named after them as well, the legends are named after them. And round the corner there somewhere, they go fix up the cars, make sure it's all ready to go. And then the route that we took to get here, is the same route that the race to warm up the cars to get to the actual tra track. This is actually incredible. This is history. Like we're experiencing it in a different way, and I'm so I feel so privileged. There's so many cars here. They're like TVR, which I absolutely love TVRs. There's a classic Rolls Royce there, uh, Lamborghinis, McLaren. And what we're we missing? And this is this shit, shit, 500, whatever. 500 horsepower. 500 horsepower. Oh yeah. Not to 60 in what? Not to 60 in about half an hour. <laughs> First things first, what's going on? Oh, yeah, I'm about to jump in the Ford GT. Sorry, what? <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Ford GT. You're about to what? Oh, you're it's you're about to be have... mad. I gotta go, man. My Uber, my Uber's here. All right, cool. My Uber's here. <laughs> Peace out. See you in a bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So the moment you're in normal mode, if you turn the dial by your left thumb, yeah. uh, turn it up one. So now you're in sport mode. Just okay that, it's just getting rid of the comfort dampers. So now you'll see the gear is now prioritized and the speed moves off to the right. Uh, so now you'll notice the accelerator is much more sensitive. The gear changes will be held longer and will be faster as well. Acceleration. 
if we get a, if we get a clear space, we'll um, we'll see if we can do some braking as well because that'll blow your head as well. So if you accelerate a bit up to the back of that uh, Renault Espace. Now is going to go in there and have lunch as well, just as the drivers did, which I think is incredible. And uh, over there's the Ford GT, which I've just been driving. Like I've actually driven the Ford GT. That is incredible. It's so fast, braking is sick. Uh, 